Hello guys, welcome back to my channel Golden Nanotech. Today I have a laptop uh, Asus. This model number X554L. And guys, I have to change the hard disk to SDD, SDD to SSD. And now you can see here is need to install Windows. But uh, when I install the UEF board is not working with this USB because USB 3. So I have to connect here the another port USB. And I have to some settings for BIOS. Press F2 to restart computer and press F2 for settings BIOS. Here you can see. So I go to the advanced set. Here is uh, SATA configuration. I have to check SATA is okay. And then I go to the boot. And you can see here is the Kingstone fast boot. And uh, launch CSA mode. This is the legacy boot. So I change this only the uef boot is enabled so you can see here is the uef fast boot is kingstone drive and then the fine uh, 480 gb ssd and then hard disk so if I, you can change go to the hard drive and fast boot fine so you have to favor fast boot kingstone and then come back and then go to the uh, next security and you can see here is the security boot menu and here you can see secure boot is disabled so if you have secure boot is enabled you have to make disable and then you can change the bios settings and now i have to go save change and exit so i have to press enter and then yes if you use the uef shell from the files so next now i have to wait for restart computer and automatic boot you can see and press enter First, you have to make the USB drive bootable and then you can install Windows 10 on your laptop. So this way you can install Windows 10 on this laptop to settings BIOS and then make the fast boot USB drive and then install Windows 10, the ASUS or all the old model laptop. If you change the hard disk SDD to SSD, it will be work the better than before. And now you can see it's loading windows and this is the four generation is core i3 and the hard disk uh, now 480 gb and the ram 4 gbs so it's a normal laptop is not very high configuration so now i am installing windows 10 on this system you can see after that press next and press install and then now select the, i don't have the product key if you have the product key select product key so i don't have i select i don't have product key and then here you have to install windows 10 pro and the press next all the 64 bit you can install uh, 64 32 and then uh, 64 bit is better than 32 because if you install more uh, ram it will be not work so 64 bit is better and then go the custom install and you can see here is the hard disk only uh, 480 gbs so I have to make a partition for C I make the 150 GBs and then I make the another partition is D so you can see here is done and then I make another partition is 300 GBs and only one partition is good and I go to the third partition the partition number 3 and then press next and now installing the windows after complete installing I will show you guys after complete install windows select language and yes and just a moment wait and then keyboard usa and then yes escape if you want to another layer you can add or you can make the escape and here you have to don't have i don't have internet so do not connect internet if you connect internet you need asking the email or password so continue without limited setup And type here the username and then uh, without password enter and then accept enter another accept enter just a moment to finish this setup and you can see guys this laptop is finished initial windows and now how can you bring the desktop icon how can you bring the desktop icon press the right click on mouse in the empty place and personalize and then go to the 
here is the themes and make the big this one and desktop icon you can see here is the desktop icon and this check on the all the files and press ok and you can see here is the desktop icon you can see here computer and this pc all is coming so I have one more so guys thank you please like share and subscribe my channel for so guys another settings how can you bring the hard disk after format you can see here is only one partition showing so how can i bring the hard disk so i press the right click of, on this pc press the right click on this pc and then go to the manage you can see manage and then you have to wait to disk management you have to find this option disk management and go to the disk management and you can see here is the another partition is 300 GB is not working so you just right click and delete the volume okay delete and then you can see the black color and then right click and the new simple volume and next 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 alas it will be make your partition so now you go you can see your another partition so any laptop you can see after format is not showing your partition so go to the uh, this pc and go to the manage and go to the disk management and then the delete partition volume and make the new partition volume and now guys i i have to check the laptop is working good or no so i take restart and check how long time need to restart see is very faster working now after i change the hard disk SDD to SSD is working very fast. See guys. So this is my another new channel. GNT Mamon for the Arabic video. If you want to Arabic video. Uh, on this channel. You can see. It's working very fast. So thank you guys. Please like share and subscribe my channel for the new video. And hit the bell icon.